I thought that I would do something a little bit different, um, sort of vlog style, very casual. I thought I'd just take you along on all of my pottery chores today. So um, I don't really have a list planned out, um, but I have like a little mental list. I need to get the bisque kiln loaded up. I've got stuff I need to glaze. Um, and I haven't been out in the studio in a little while um, because I've been mostly doing glazing. Um, so I don't know if there's any chores out there that I need to finish up because I have a pottery class at the end of the week. Um, so yeah, I thought I'd take you with me. So let's go. So it looks like I do have some cleanup to do. Um, I kind of left the pottery studio a bit of a mess um, because, well, my life has been a bit of a mess, to be honest. Um, yeah, I had to put down my cat this week and on top of just my grandma recently passing and all that stuff, I've just, you know, things have been half done for a while. So, um, and that's okay. Sometimes life isn't perfect and not everything's gonna get done but I definitely need to get back on track um, now that I am wrapping up the wholesale order that I have been working on for a long time um, so that way I kind of have a clean slate to start working on my own stuff so I've got just stuff I need to put away um, it looks like the wheel I did some trimming and never finished cleaning that up so we're gonna clean that up and then I have a few boards of mugs and oddball stuff that I need to put in the mist kiln and then as well as some pottery from a pottery class that I've been teaching. So I'm gonna get this stuff loaded up and then just pick up a few items and then we'll get to glazing. So time to clean up.
studio pretty clean now. I got to mop it and pick up a few things, emptied out all of the greenware into the kiln. So yeah, I'm satisfied with this for now. And I think I'm gonna get a snack because I'm hungry and then we'll get to blazing. you all thought I was gonna take you back out to the studio but no I would say probably like I don't know like 90% of my glazes are brush on glazes and so I do it from the comfort of my couch um, because I like my TV I'm not above TV <laughs> and so I can just turn on a show to zone out and paint some pottery. Um, the dipping glazes definitely don't do in my living room. Those I'll either do out on my patio or in the studio. But for these brush on glazes, it's clean enough that I can do it in my house. So why not? So I just hold up close, bring in my board of pottery and veg out. So I'm gonna go ahead and time lapse this and I'm going to be eating my little snackaroo here and drinking some caffeine and just then I'll into some place.
Hello again. A full day has passed. Uh, I got super busy after glazing that last board of pottery and so I needed to go and uh, go to errands and things like that. So I had to stop for the day. I didn't get everything glazed. Um, but I did get the bisque kiln running and that's now cooling. It's almost cooled. So I think it's at like 150 right now. So I need it to cool a little bit more first um, before I can pull those out. And then we'll start loading up the kiln with glazeware. So I think that's going to give me enough time to glaze this last board of pottery. So I'm going to get to glazing and then we will unload and reload the kiln. This kiln <laughs> is catching no breaks from me this week. Here we go.
right guys, that is it for today. And that is it for this video. I've got the glaze kiln running now and I'll hopefully be unloading that, probably not tomorrow, but the day after um, to give it enough time to cool. But yeah, I am now going to cook some dinner and feed my babies and hopefully relax a little bit this evening. So I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog style video. Let me know what you think. And of course, subscribe. Thanks so much, guys. Bye.